Right. right now I'm not looking for a I'm getting this other card along here. General Lysander, I guess, is how you would pronounce that. Alright, now let's go get the part that he wants. Hmm, I almost exploded those. That would be a silly thing to do. And I don't think I can go that way to get the part anyway, so let's just go around. Five, five. So down this way. Oh, there it is. So we need to go around this big heap of... That's junk. I don't care what anyone says. That's junk. Degenerated junk, nonetheless. Alright, let's get this part and give it back to him. Navigate my way out of this junkyard or treasure mine, according to the general. I don't ever think you discover his first name either. His card doesn't have any spoilers. Let's let's see if his first name's on it. I don't think it is. General. Nope. General, I have the parts, even though you don't have the card to install them into yet. No, this doesn't apply to just other, like, cop cards and stuff. It only applies to your card, from what I understand. What do you want again? Here. So, have you found what we needed? Yes, it's right there. This is it. This will save is. your life someday, son. What, some Sure know parts? how to exaggerate. <laughs> Engine Stop boost calling is vital me. for bringing back soldiers alive from war. Engine boost. Of course. Engine boost is the basis of everything. Let me tell He's you talking. a war story, son. <gasps> story I was leading my unit at the very front line. Things were bad, and sanitary conditions were worse. Endless guerrilla attacks were stripping us of our manpower. Everyone was tired to their limits. There was one sergeant who really rubbed me the wrong way. The boys like to call him Crybaby Timothy. Sounds really like Thomas. Gave me headaches, I can tell you. How? Just by breathing. <laughs> His posture was bad. He was weak, slow, easily distracted. I have no idea who thought he was capable of combat in a war zone. He was he the medic? The lives of every member of the unit. Stomach pains. The worst stomach ache ever. Every one of us. It was just cooking. He was using food that was contaminated. Then it wasn't Thomas. He into the dugout toilet like an Apache chopper returning to base. I have to tell you, it was a close call. My engine was boosting. And that's what got me there safely. Right in the nick of time. What that happened to the unit? You really want to know? It was a terrible sight. Powerful, athletic men reduced to walking dead, blinking like crazy, shaking with pain. Their confidence and self-esteem were all crushed. From diarrhea. They almost didn't recover. An interesting story. <laughs> so you see the need oh, for another hernia. boost now, do you? I'll keep my side of the promise and get to work on your vehicle. That doesn't exist yet. But good job. I like the effort. That badge on him is for a sergeant. Looks like it was sewn on something else before it was sewn onto his shirt. I wonder what that's all about. Maybe he's really, like, the crazy guy. I put in longer pistons and optimized your lower gears. That should add boost to your speed when you accelerate. But there's still plenty of stuff I can do to make your car go faster. Just come see me again and I'll customize your car a little more. 
Alright, that's one quest done. We can't do another one until like a day goes by or whatever. <laughs> and we got some trading cards, which gave me some extra more, which is always nice. Alright, let's see if Sigourney's wandered off anywhere. Or if she's still nearby. And last we looked. Yep, she's still nearby. So we just need to follow up on her and go pick her up. I think I'll just do these two quests because you guys wanted you guys wanted to see a couple quests, so figured I'd treat you and be nice. Because I'm just that awesome tree! <gasps> oh, that was pro. Wait, there's a car oh that's George's house, that's why there's a card at George's house. Main reason I'm picking these up, like I said, I'm not gonna collect them all except maybe once I beat it again just so I have a um, complete collection, but um, as you can see, you get a nice hunk of change each time you pick up a card. It's like two hundred dollars, so it'll be nice for when I go buying suits like crazy. George's card. All right, this time we're gonna go pick up Sigourney. Where'd my car go? Oh. I wish it would just stop and park wherever I left it. That'd be so much easier, but no, we're gonna park it neatly for you, like, half a mile away from where you actually stopped. Well, gee, thanks. Where are you, Sigourney? You are. Straight ahead. Sigourney. I don't want to drive past her. Oh, there she is. Oh, it's really obvious. There she is. I forgot that, that, that. Get out of the car. Sigourney! What you doing? Hey, Sigourney. I'm glad you're here. My pot, it's getting cold. Please, oh my God. let's get going. Could you explain what you're talking about? Her pot. What it's are cold. you rambling on about? My pot's getting cold as we speak. Hurry, hurry, hurry! Zach, I guess we're going to have to drive her home. Yep. But I wonder what happens when her pot gets cold. She lives close to Becky's house, which is on the same road as where the hotel is. As we all know, I can never figure out where the hotel is in regards to the world. So we gotta check the Wow, first. check the car going! My house is over by the lake. Three, two, one, go! Now, I don't know if there's actually a time limit when you do these. I've always gotten her home in time, but... Actually, see, she lives right there. <laughs> this one's easy. The first one's the easiest. But, uh, yeah, I don't know if there's an actual time limit to getting her home or not. I've never... I've Why always gotten her home in time, so... Your guess is as good as mine. Well, I'm hurrying, Sigourney, relax. You're right around the corny... corny. I'm just amazingly eloquent this evening, like... Shut up, Sigourney, you're fine. Your shrubberies aren't fine. But you, in essence, you're just your daddy. Alright. And we're done. I think there's like five of these where you have to take her home. And she goes farther and farther out. So you get to, oh, you get to hear her yell at you. Thank more. you, my pot is still warm. I'm glad oh, to hear that. Why don't you take it off the stove in the first place? Keep your voice now. What, are you going to tell me a secret? The pop knows everything. Here's all. Hmm? If you can't find the person you are looking for, you need to look at things from a different angle. There is only Random. one truth, but more than one is always visible. 